that and over and over we'll continue to say the same thing until and until the government rose up to the occasion, work side by side with community leaders and at the same time take local vigilante equipped and also increase manpower of our security forces, the police, the army, the air force, the navy, civil defense and any other paramilitary because we need to. We are already at war. Nowhere is safe in the country. Some are evil minded working on a script to disintegrate the country and some out of frustration, lack of employment, joblessness and idle, you know, not naturally and idle minded persons will always be thinking of crime. So in that line, those are the things that come together and almost at the same time. So it's a big blue. The country must rise up to the occasion. We must agree that there is a challenge. We must agree that, yes, all hands must be on that. We must all agree that not only the government is because the hours of complaint, blaming government is over. There's nothing to complain about anymore. There's nothing you're going to say different from what was never said before. So I don't think this is a time for complaint or criticizing anyhow. We must be safe to work Side by side, and if the government has issues, they are not getting up to the expectation. We must not also leave everything in their hands. Let us all work in the best interest of the country to ensure that because it's right. Because once there is no country, then there is nothing you can complain about. We will only help that. So I'm of the view that all hands must be on deck now to save the country. The country is their need of supported manship and anything that will bring about the unity of the country. Peace, finally. It has been widely speculated, and uh, to an extent, because the government is not even too far from the agitations and advocacy of state policing. I understand the former IG come up with an idea of uh, state policing, and I understand that uh, probably it has been uh, agreed, uh, and I think effort is being put in place to, to address it. So for me, uh, I've always been an advocate of state policing and even community policing, so that everybody will be part and parcel of the community. So I think it's a good deal. I will not want to go in line with that and believe that uh, there's any cause for panic for now. Okay. Uh, yes, we are, we, we clamor for state policy. Okay. Uh, and uh, the government, to an extent, uh, make pronouncement. And I could remember RFI committee okay. also made mention of that as they are part of recommendation okay. for the state policy. Okay. So for me, it is done and it has to be. It's just unfortunate that the North has not picked up on regards to our own internet like any other region is doing. Okay. And I hope the state, the Northern State governors, okay. will begin to think of that because that is what we advocate for. Okay. So, and I hope whoever is forming the, the security, committee, policing, or whatever they are doing, should be with a good, genuine, okay. good intent. Not to use it as a means of hunting any other tribe or any religion that is not really part of where it's coming from. Okay. I just hope they will be able to check me some of these SSEs. Okay. But we need it. We need it. That who is not in good book or who is not in... I, I, well, they are not supporting, like, they are not supporting Tunubu's ambition uh, if it comes out in 2022. Well, it's a choice. If you had asked me, yes. my group, yes. I'm in better position to say, well, it is too early to even to say... Okay whether I want him or not. Okay. And I'm not the type that believes that I should put the cat before the horse. Oh, good. But one thing we cannot compromise, if that is what is referred to, I guess, in the book, is that never again we will allow any old politician to occupy our space anymore. Yeah. So, and I'm sure he is above since and we are looking at something since that word is what we are looking at now for 50. So okay. that is so automatically going by our own analysis, going by what we feel uh, is already disqualified. <laughs> We will create our own, and of course we have our own. We have so many of them. We have younger elements that are thinking and inspiring. You have younger ones, even within the governor circles, you have them. And even within the past people, even within the National Assembly, you have some people who are also preparing to declare their interest. So it will be too early to even begin to talk of that. And I believe strongly we have. In fact, I do know of one or two that are very young, and they are at the age of less than even 50, or 50, by the way. Okay.